like you'll never see me again. Ho, ho, ho. Hey guys. So I said I was going live every single day until the album comes out. So that's what I'm doing. You do love to see it, Derek. I just shot the biggest cover of my career. Super blessing, super, super blessing. Did it quarantine style. Very, very cool. Um, I'm excited about it. I don't know. That was crazy. And I'm very excited for you guys to see it and for you guys to read it. And album comes out in eight days. And I just dropped a new song and a new video today. Fucking makeup. How do you guys like it? Do you guys like it? Tell me in the comments. Oh yeah, run it! She said, "Want me to run it? Period. Run it, Tiara." We gotta turn up, and then me and Jahan tonight, y'all. We supposed to be social distancing. Hi, Daniel. I miss your life. Eight days. We both know it's never really goodbye. I swear it's like we do this all the time. Yeah. Be turning me on. I can't oh, Can't make up like it's Maybelline We do petty things to mess up the shit, yeah You be running back once you let it go I, I have a really fun fact about this song We just fucking make up like it's Maybelline Ooh. We do petty Ooh. things to mess up the shit He fly, won't go produce this song I said 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 Cause a scene just so you could what? take it off You handle it different when you really get to tripping And I miss it when you get it like that, that, that Ain't no cap, cap, cap I'll make you mad, mad, mad Why I gotta fuck you up to make you fuck like that You can buy it so you can put it down like that Get in your bag like that, yeah I hate you Turns into I love you in a better room We can make up like it's Maybelline We do pretty things To mess up the shades yeah. You be running back Once you let it go I already know Did it time before We just want to make up like it's Okay James Will you get on live with me? I'll wait for your comments Cause I would like you to join my live just for a second Just for a freaking second Guys Did you enjoy the video? The video When I thought of the video I was like okay how can I utilize my house And how can I And I would already like I had already seen John a bunch of times you know right in the beginning of the quarantine that's the lead guy in the video I was like how can we shoot this like and I thought of like what if you we shoot your part at your house so me and my photographer who I've been quarantined with went to go shoot at at his house and got his parts and then we went to go shoot my parts at my house and Yanni actually taught me the choreography with videos so she sent me videos that she had worked on and I learned the choreography on the videos and she came over once because she'd been quarantined in my garage in front of my garage to teach me from six feet away which was very crazy but I learned the choreography I freestyled a little bit um James I'm Hey. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Nice. Good. 
by the new song. Thank you. I Beautiful. appreciate that. Did you see the video? Oh, wow. Not yet. You got to watch the video. Oh, I'd love to. It's pretty this tight. Is so, I haven't, you know, this is literally my first time ever IG living with someone. Really? <laughs> I'm making James Bond. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Your shit sounds great. Yeah. How's quarantine? Did you hear me? Much my better. Oh. Oh, okay. Now you can see me. Now, What's that? now we got you back. How's quarantine going? There we go. Um, I mean. We good? <laughs> you know, right. Right. Don't you know, push it. Quarantine. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not in my car listening to my new music at the moment. So, <laughs> not as good as you. Well, you know, sometimes you got to take drives. Sometimes true. drives make all the difference. True, true. Especially with new shit. Hi. How's the reception, Matt? Oh, yeah, she says she sends her love. Oh, I got, hey, girl, I got the microwave reception going on right now. No, it's good. I, I mean, like... how's the reception to your music, not the reception oh. to your phone? <laughs> People like it. People like it a lot. It's crazy. Right. Um, I almost told a secret. Um, yeah, they're liking it a lot, and I'm excited. My album drops in Good. eight days. I'm very excited for I'm you, excited. as well as excited as a as a as a fan. It's great. Yeah, can't wait. I'm excited too. Where are you driving? I'm on my way home. Great, great, great. great. Yeah, you know, on my way. For to stay home. Yeah, to stay home and be and isolate on your own with nobody else. Yes, that is it. That is what I'm doing. I actually have to edit another video, so I will be at home editing. Okay. And thank you for hopping on my live. I'm. It's my fucking pleasure. You know that. <laughs> Happy to fucking be here, dude. <laughs> I think there's such a big delay that I can't even understand what's going on so i'm gonna go but <laughs> you're the best can't wait for the album loads of love thank you i'll see you soon bye i'll, I'll talk to you soon bye yeah you will bye, bye. <laughs> i love james y'all i'm a jimmy blake stand. tracks on that thing i think 15 tracks that i'm geeked about i mean some of a, a couple of them are interludes so they don't really count but it's a lot of songs on there some collabs i'm really really excited about i'm waiting for one more verse to come in it's up g rye it's up and then we making an album fuck everybody uh G. Rye is in the comments. He produced Toxic. Um, but I'm excited, man. Like, I don't know how to explain it. I don't think I've ever been this excited about a project. In my eyes. 
Is there a theme to the album? I will say I feel like the theme to the album is that perspective of thing of duality in relationships where things can simultaneously be good and bad and they always go back and forth like this they always go good and bad you know even when things are bad you feel like it's good and you're in it or sometimes you're so blind in it that you feel like it's good and it's bad um and or just when things are really good until it's not you know but it's forever that 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 bounce back that back and forth thank you i miss you like this Tesla's now Hi Kyle, I'm going home, Bookie. I'm going home. I just shot the biggest cover. Quarantine style. We doing everything quarantine style up here. And I gotta go home and edit this other video for y'all. I'm trying to shoot as many uh videos as possible for this album. I'm gonna keep giving them to y'all because I'm shooting them just me and my photographer, now my videographer. She's the co-founder of my production company, just me, me her, and my videographer Gabe. Gabe is currently self-quarantining because he is high risk. So it's been just me and Bree shooting every video. I cannot explain to you how hard it is. Like, I don't know how to work regular, like, Microsoft Word. Like, I don't know how to work regular computer programs. So, like, having to get on there and learning Adobe Premiere Pro has been crazy. Hi, Buck. I miss you. I hope your family is well. Uh, but having to learn Adobe Premiere Pro from scratch, and it's like not even just here to go learn Adobe Premiere Pro and learn it to do some little funny shit, but I got to learn Adobe Premiere Pro to, to, to push it out. It's nerve-wracking. So just know I did have a really crazy plan for this album. I had this idea, I had these crazy just video ideas and roller ideas and the cover shoot and we had to scrap everything and, and start over and do it from scratch and do it on the fly and on the wing. So I'm winging it and I'm learning as I go. And I think that that is what's going to, that's what's so impressive to me about this project. And I think that that's why I'm going to be, I'm going to remember this project forever and I'm most proud of this project than any of my other projects because I I did the most I think and I put the most work in on my behalf um and I'm just I'm proud of it I'm proud of everything it took to get to this point so dang Maybelline just start following me on Twitter hey sorry for the cuss words hi Samantha Thank you, Greg. Hi, Amanda. Yeah, man. We just, we really just happy to be here. We are happy to, to have access to the computer program that we have and have the equipment that we need to make these videos because I would just, I would just be putting out a, oh, my girl. I keep it juicy, juicy. I eat that on me. She keep that booty, booty. She keep that mommy. Are y'all excited for this Nicki Minaj remix? Hold on. If you can see it from the front, I'm so excited for this Nicki Minaj Say So remix, y'all. I could cry. I'm as excited as I was for Beyonce and Megan. Like, this is crazy. And I'm just so happy that everybody is, like, so embracing all the new girls. It's so tight. I stand. Hey, hey. Hi, Nate. Thank you. Lisi Nash. Oh, that's my girl. Hey, everybody's in the thing. This is my uh, Wakari job. I have a Porsche Macan. I am a barb. I am a part of the beehive. I don't know what Doja Cat stands are called, but I am one of those. I'm a Kiana Lede. We Kiana Lede stands in this house. I'm not tired. We stand Janae in this house. I'm going to go right into the garage. I got to get to work. Oh, I got my tag hanging out my booty. Got a bag. Red. Kittens, kittens. I'm a kitten. 
You can see it from the back? Crazy. When I don't got my keys on now, my assistant got my keys in my front door. It's open? Shit. Hi. Hello. How's it going? I'm on live. Don't say nothing incriminating. No. That's it. My album comes out in eight days. Are you so excited? What is this chili soup. with mushrooms, dude? Soup, dude. Black bean soup. Under my Look soup. at you, dude. I'm proud of you. Is Brie here? No. Okay. I'm like, what the fucking mushrooms in your chili, you nasty fuck? Okay, so welcome to my created space. This is my created space. I'm not going to show you because uh, I want to... A phone stand. Did I order a phone stand? Yeah, I didn't order a phone stand. Hey, little rail. Weird, because it sucks. Someone ordered it from Amazon under my name. Oh, I didn't order a phone stand. Like, oh, that's strange, but I'll keep a phone stand. Well, yeah, this is my creative space. It is just my garage. And uh, back there, we got a recording studio. Over here, we got my video editing studio. And apparently, someone was doing core workouts on this computer. But this is where I edit my videos. Um, this used to just be where I kept all of my extra shit for the house. But now, this is my workspace. So, um, I'm just I'm blessed to have this space because editing videos on my um oh fun fact about a song i didn't videos laying down on my bed was just strenuous <laughs> so uh and i've always wanted to direct videos and shoot videos and edit videos but i never had the time to sit down and learn but quarantine has got me to that point and now i am here The fun fact about the song was just that T Fly vocal produced fucking makeup. It's so crazy. Yeah, yeah. If you could see it from where's the ceiling? I'm in an I'm in a garage. This is the ceiling of my garage. This is somebody old house. This is my my uh temporary spot. I was supposed to buy a house this year, but I'm still renting. I was supposed to just wait until after the Justin Bieber tour and then like buy my first crazy house because I wanted to retire my mom and then buy my house. But now I have bought I have just retired my mom and just, you know, did that. Hey P. My biggest inspiration while writing depends on what I'm going through. I'm very like Whatever I'm going through at the time, uh, I, I tend to do that. I'm on live. Don't say nothing incriminating. That's my quote. I say that all the time. Do you need to discuss something with me? Uh -huh. Oh, so how do I live, Diali? Hello. Don't worry. David has been quarantined. Quarantine, this, is quarantine. this is our first time seeing each other in, um, what, like two weeks, like two months? Yeah. It's crazy. I'm usually with this man every single day. Hello, everyone. Tom, Tom, thanks for listening. Yeah, thank you for listening. We appreciate y'all. I can't tell. He doesn't want me to tell you guys how many views we got in the first hour of the video, but it's quite a lot of views. You guys was running that thing up, so I do appreciate it. Love you. Shut up, man. Thank you. Isn't it nice? It's so cool. I love this. Yeah, we've been in here every day, all night, just right here in this heat, going very crazy. What's that? Stuff to make us lip gloss. You're going to make lip gloss? Yo, let me tell. Come here, Sierra. Sierra is the GOAT. Sierra is my assistant, and Sierra is like the fucking DIY Pinterest queen. Sierra learns how to do everything. Sierra learned how to do her own nails. She made me a, like, recording sign for outside the garage in case I'm in here working. Um, you don't make lip gloss. and now she's learning how to make lip gloss. Do you know I only like clear? Well, yeah, then I got some nudes. Oh, you make me a little light nude, that's cute. 
Hi, Shamik. Um, what was I going to say? I do want to come to Brazil. I want to come to Brazil so bad. Like, I don't know. How long you guys think this is going to go? Like, they just extended our our uh, stay-at-home situation till June here. And I don't know what that means. Like, I don't know how I feel about it. Um, but shit. Hope it doesn't last forever, but it might just be forever. Bach, I would love to shoot a video. I can't wait to take a break, not not take a break from music because I took a, I took quite a long break um, after I was pregnant. But hi, Lauren, come on, Oakland Queen, man. You know one thing I'm so sad about that video not coming out is I we shot a video in Oakland for for a project that never came out, and we put like so many of my homegirls. So many of my homegirls, so many, like, dope, like, just girls in Oakland coming up in a video, and it's never coming out. <sighs> but just know, everybody was mad cute. It was very cute. Huh? Um, I'm just taking a picture of you. <laughs> uh, I don't know why I have hips on live stuff in my head. Hi, Uncle Trent. Man, I love y'all too. Thank y'all for holding me down through all of this. It's been crazy, but, you know, the blessings go up. Hi, ya yeah, yeah. Y'all are so excited. I am so excited too. What? I have not I have not dropped an album. Hi, Fabo. Fabo said hi. I said hello. Mama Flo. Man, of course. Honestly, I might at some point put that entire video out. What you think? After the album come out, should we re release the full version of Change Your Life video? Fine. Yeah, might as well. Oh, shit. Right. Talk about the deluxe. Of course, there will be a deluxe version of the album with probably like some SoundCloud stuff, some of the SoundCloud we'll drops. Yeah, we'll talk about that soon. But tell you one feature on the album. No, <laughs> you're so lucky. I'm here with David because I would spill secrets, and David is here, and he is not letting me. Um, but I'm so excited too, guys. I promise I will go live every single day for my album. So that is what I'm doing. I'm going live every single day. Should I be giving you a warning as to when I go live? Also, I discovered in this quarantine that I prefer myself without eyelash extensions, I think. Look at that. Look at that. They're going crazy. Um, yeah, I think I should start going live at a specific time, huh? But, you know, I have a baby and I be working and... I don't really know whenever I'm going to do it, but what time should we do it? What time is it? 4 p.m. in California? Who's that? Ah, thank you. Thank you. Tell your boyfriend what's up. Tell him we appreciate the love. That's the lady who works at YouTube. She loves my video. We appreciate the love. I'll be back. She loves my video. Hey, Daniela. Daniela, I heard we done with the album. I heard we done. I heard we finished. We just waiting on one at first. All, all the songs are turned in. All the songs are turned in. Everything is mixed minus. Hi, Brett. I miss you, dude. I got to stop saying dude. It's all, the, it's all Rosa's fault. Um... Go live while I day is napping. See, the problem with that is my baby don't really nap that long. She does not nap that long. She takes these really quick, cute naps. Hi, Jordan Jones. Where she just... Down and back up. Dude, I miss you, Ronald. Wow. They can hear you. You can spill the beans. Walk away. <laughs> Where is she right now? She's with her dad. Dad. Hi, Ka. Oh my God, I missed the gang. 
Wow, hi, Nia. Um, but yeah, what else do I have to check off the list? Eight days. I think at first I was going to upload a picture of me. Oh, that lizard's so big. Whew. I was going to post a picture of me in front of the wall every day, but I think that that's too many, too many pictures. So I'll probably do the ninth. I'll do the sixth and I'll do the third. Do I take care of my day and myself? I mean, I'm her mommy, but I have a house full of people. I'm, I have my siblings live with me. Uh, my assistant lives with me. My little play brother that's been with me since he was 14 lives with me. So we have a loving, super amazing village. And she loves everybody, and everybody just loves her. Like, I don't know how it will ever be if she ever has to go be alone somewhere because she is surrounded by people. I'm going to put your tags on your clock, Okay. And I'm going to put the tags in your clock. Okay. Why did I stop smoking? Hi, Steven. What's ahead of my life? Once ahead of my life. What's up, gangsters? How y'all doing? This is Steven, everybody. This is a celebration. This is a celebration. It sure is. Uh, it sure is. I brought, yeah, I'm, I'm I'm super blessed. My daughter is super blessed, honestly. So she is. She's a lot of people that love her around all day. Hi, Franklin. Hi, Frankie Doodles. Franklin, fat y'all. Franklin left and came back and got chunky on us. We love to see it. What's up, Uzi? How's it going? Y'all finna dance? Michaela, don't do too much. Is you finna dance? Is you finna dance? What's Steven's at? I know, huh? Steven's adorable. You want Steven! To dance? Steven! Steven, they love you! Said, uh, someone said, you take care of the people, you mind your own, be you love hard. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. The queen is in the live. Oh, Michaela. <laughs> Steven! I know my neighbors probably are so confused by me all the time because I'm always shooting videos in the cul-de-sac and flying a drone around to practice and uh Bree is out here and we have the garage door open you gaining weight i'm definitely gaining weight i'm yoking up yoking up my nails are cute are they are my nails are my nails giving you Delta vibes? Oh, her reason was. Whose reason? Whose reason for stopping smoking? Oh, no, yeah, my reason for smoking. Steven, they just love you, and they want to know you're at, and they just said you're so fine, and they just love you. Everybody, this is Steven. He dances, he sings. He thinks he Omarion. He be hey, in my... I'm trying to be. You know what I mean? I'm trying to catch up, y'all. I'm trying to catch up. Steven is from... Let's do an interview, tell Steven. Her, tell her, add me, add me on my TikTok, y'all. Like on me. your TikTok, friend. Your TikTok, you Let's know? tag your Instagram TikTok. down here. Steven IG is... Now, TikTok. don't laugh at my hair. You feel me? Like, it's cool. Steven, too. what's your Instagram? Let's see. Steve No. Can you do it? I got it, I got it, y'all. Let me see. It's love, y'all. It is all love. There you go. Okay. This is Steven. How do I pin the... How do I pin the... Oh, even the only be on live. I don't know. We don't know, y'all. I'm trying to know. Okay. I pinned the comment. This is Steven. Let's do an interview, Steven. Copper okay. Squad. Boom. Oh. Steven, where are you from, Steven? So I am from St. Louis, Missouri. St. Louis, Missouri. What do you do? St. Louis, Missouri, y'all. I'm an artist, you feel me? I'm a creative mind. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. I'm just into the arts, you feel me? And I like ink, as y'all can see. So. Yeah. One yeah. half of his body blasted. You're, no, you're pretty blasted, no, dude. You're blasted. Yeah, no, I see these. Um, 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 how long you knew you wanted to be like Baby Omarion? 
You know what? <laughs> I have been wanting to be Baby Omorion <laughs> slash Michael Jackson. There we go. The original. Uh, since I was like 13, y'all. Like, Steven, they want to know if you like girls. I love them. Love them. Steven is a lazy fly guy, lady killer. Okay. <laughs> what y'all talking about? <laughs> Uh, what else can I ask you, Steve? Man, what's your sign, Steven? I'm a tourist, y'all, but don't tell nobody, it's a secret. I didn't know you was a tourist. <laughs> oh, I just found this out. I didn't know this. Do I got an accent, y'all? Because everybody been telling me, Steven, I got an you definitely got an accent. And really, the whole plot on putting you on my live is because I'm just, I'm honestly, girls, you could go follow Steven. I know you want to. Come on, y'all. All the girls. I TikToks too, y'all. All the girls. Yeah, he keeps follow his damn TikToks. We can stop mentioning it. <laughs> it's like follow my TikTok. Get Stephen hey, cracking on the top. Y'all better grab the album too. She That's for sure. On the top. No, actually, Stephen, you is fake popping on TikTok. Hey, listen, listen. Y'all better TikTok. grab this motherfucking album. Shit That's what on I there. Know. There we go. Yeah, I want some real shit, some real R&B. Destin! Okay, get up, Steven. Destin, yep. sit down. Thank you, Steven. Thank you for having me. Thank you Thank for coming on the show. Go follow Steven. Go follow Steven right now. I know I know, y'all want to follow Steven. Sit down, Destin. Let's do an interview. Sit down, Destin. Fuck! This is my little brother. I don't like being interrogated. This is Destin. Now, Destin could sing. Destin is our king. We stand. Okay. We do stand, Destin. Destin, what's your latest track called? Onions. Destin, I'm... Why you can't be regular? What's your song called? My song? That you dropped. Called... Close you. <laughs> Close you by Jamie. Ronald Turner. said Destiny was T. <laughs> Jamie. Jeremy, tell this little boy, get it together. He came out here talking about onions. Uh, oh my God, Kelly Rowland says you a cutie. Kelly Rowland. We Rowland. stand <laughs> Kelly in this house. Yeah. Hi, Kelly. Wow, this is rare. Legendaric. Um, legendary. Legendarical. Yeah. Wow, I. I don't even care about your interview anymore. Kelly Rowland's in Kelly here. <laughs> Destin, I mean, Kelly, you should go check out Destin's <laughs> song because we we stand. And I like your new song and video a lot. You look really, really beautiful. Um, Destin, where are you from, dude? I'm from Temple, Florida. Is you? Mm-hmm. Yo, Temple, Florida, Florida man. Hashtag Florida man. Hashtag Florida man. It probably gets buck in there. <laughs> I mean, you do. We do. We do know it gets buck in Florida. Um, what do you do for a living? I uh, now I make music. I I do that now. And he's really good at it. He's so good at it. Yes, go Ow. stream closure by Destin Conrad. Run it up, run it up. If you could have any other career besides music, what would it be? Um, Dream like you 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 could skip the schooling part of it and everything if you have to oh, go to school. For it. What would it be? Uh, I don't know. Maybe something to do with animals, dentistry. You would be a dentist. Maybe. I mean, not not shaming the dentists out right. there. God bless y'all, Brian Trey. What's the deal? I hope the show Thank you. Dentist. I don't know about being in people's mouths all day. What about the hot I mean, breath? What gloves. about the halitosis? <laughs> you want to be all in the halitosis every day? Mm. Hey, people, teeth and gums be rotten, and you got to, like, if they okay, be Okay, so you know what's fresh, Maybe, like, a zookeeper. You Ooh, gotta go you're giving me so exotic. <laughs> Killed her husband. Whacked him. Um... But yeah, I would not be a dentist. I think I would be a surgeon. I don't know how much surgery stinks. Probably does a little bit. But I think I'd be a a surgeon or something. Or maybe I just watch too much Grey's Anatomy because that's also highly fucking possible. Hey, Johnny Blaze. Thanks, dude. I like your voice. 
What's Destin's favorite song on the album? What's your favorite song on the album? Yo, okay, I have a secret, right? There's a song that's a two-part song. And Destin snapped on the writing on the second half of the two-part song. Um, so I'll say the first half of that song is probably my favorite song on the album. Even though he snapped on the second half. So. And... Oh, maybe the one that came out today. That's one of my favorites. Fucking makeup like it's Maybelline. With anything. You'll be running back. Won't you let it go? I already know. Look, what's Destin's at? Destin's, Destin's at is at Destin Bonrad. How do I pin this? Yeah, the girls are giving transitions. Here go Ka talking about we want Steven back. Ka, Ka go to bed. Go to bed, Ka Spencer. The internet got ten percent. Look at that. I know my phone dying. You've been online for a while. I took a shower. You did not take a shower I, since when I walked in the yes, house. Yes, I did. That was the shortest shower. It was like a good like twenty. 15. You was I have not been on live for for thirty minutes. Hi, Mozzie. Have I been on live for thirty minutes? No. No. Have I? No. David just walking away every time. I love the billing. He don't love the what? The billing? I'm dead. <laughs> My man just keep walking out having. <laughs> Took a bird bath. Oh, yeah. Gabe, make 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 us a little uh, make D Gabe G at GC Phoenix is currently going through. Yo, Kalani, where's my lesbian theme music videos? Well, I am quarantined, and I'm not quarantined with any. Well, Bree's not Bree's not a lesbian, but I would never kiss Bree to have her be in my video. <laughs> that is my brother. <laughs> So, you won't be getting any lesbian theme videos for me because I'm not quarantined with anybody I can make a lesbian video with. Mm. Sorry. Can we get a Mozzie and Kaylani? I fucking love Mozzie. You know I got the Wally on me. How many songs being blessed with? 15. Well, not Jay Valentine. <laughs> Ronald said fish are friends not food I have I'll tell you I have a song it's very it's obviously you know, about a girl mm -hmm. y'all might catch the name yes. maybe you me I'm a little hungry but I'm not pressed I'm ordering what you ordering oh, any recommendations nah you just gotta look bro oh, so man. many we eat very <laughs> differently <laughs> virtual release party yeah that's the plan okay I'm done right Virtual, virtual release party. Details coming next week. Is it on, on Zoom? Details coming next week. I'm having a virtual release party. We're going to party. I'm going to play the songs. Wow. Virtual listening party. We're going to go through all the songs. I'll talk about the songs. I'll explain some of the songs. You, you should just sit in here, sitting there with me since you were there the whole time. How old is Destin? Destin is 12. 12 and a half, baby. And a half and three quarters. Uh, let's see. What else can I answer? What's my favorite song on the album? Yeah, what's your favorite song on the album? Jeez. Someone said David Ali, Ye Ali, or Muhammad Ali. I'm going to have to go with David Ali. It was a tough choice. <laughs> but I do fuck with all the Ali's mentioned. My favorite song on the album. Damn. I might have to be a real one and say, hate the club. I hate the club. Hate the club. I, I And I just told it, spilled a bean. But I have a song on my album called Hate the Club. And it is one of my favorite songs. It's just sexy and smooth and fucking. Do What's you your other favorite? What's my other favorite? <laughs> I think Open. That's Open, thing. passionate. That shit is a, that shit is a jam. 
Uh, but what was I gonna say? Fuck, I forgot what I was gonna start. Yeah, the shit comes out in eight days, dude. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Oh, I forgot to. Ooh. That's a statue. Um, that might be my favorite, but I'm not telling you guys anymore. Hardest song to write on the album? I will be answering these questions after. After. <laughs> after. <laughs> after. God, I'm going to uh, do answer these questions on a live. Is Destin my child? Yeah. You bet. Somebody said, do you have any features? She does. I do have features, which is cool because I think on my first album, I didn't have any features. Mm. And for this album, how many do I have? Like four? Is that including the album? Four. Five. Five features. Why can't you release the song names? Because then... Then you're not even going to be geeked up when I release the freaking track list. That's why the track list is blank. That's why the track list is blank. Exactly, David. High five. It's giving blank. It's giving secret until it's time. Who's my favorite artist of all time? Wow. Wow. Of all time, and when I say favorites of art, favorite artists of all time, that means I probably listen to them like the most. Damn, it's got to be Music So Child or Indie Ari. Off the strength that I can sing so many songs top to bottom. Mm. Yeah, I'm a neo soul head. I actually didn't hear R and B, R and B until I was like almost grown. I was a straight neo soul my whole life, um, which probably explains why I had songs like Bright or things like that. Thank you, Derek King. What's my favorite song right now? My favorite song right now. Dang. What songs do I like right now? I still listen to the same shit. I like Keanu Lede a lot. Uh, I like it a lot. My favorite song right now? It might be the Doja Cat Say So song. Not for nothing, that is a slap. Slapper? A big slap. Favorite rapper of all time? Pop. Period. K Rich was cracking. This frame looks open. What was my last dream about? Ooh. Oh my god. I had the maniest dream. You know what's what I'm about to say? Mm -hmm. I had a dream. <sighs> I had a dream that I worked at a like an arena and i was like the general manager of all nba young boys holes nba young boys girls i have no idea where they came from i must have been like looking at music videos or blogs before i went to sleep also my sister listens to a lot of nba young boy so that's probably why. But I literally had a dream I was managing them. And, like, I was like, ladies, ladies, like, figure it out. Like, you don't have to fight. Like, figure it out. Hi, Mars. I was just talking about how our song is my favorite. Yeah. I don't know. Don't go on the internet and say that because I don't want, you know, anybody to think that. <laughs> that was no way shady to NBA Youngboy's life because I do stand. I think he is. <laughs> I do stand. I do think he's hilarious. And the music is good, not for nothing. It's bugs. <laughs> it's bugs. It's hot as hell is what it is. It is. I'm here for it, too. Yeah. We can't keep it easy and breezy. Hi, Juice. I miss you, Juice. How's it going? Um, they probably do need a manager, and I could. I'm that one. I'm that guy for the job. 
a referee. I fuck around was a referee. It was crazy. I woke up and I sat straight up and I was like, what the fuck was that? Like, why did that happen to me? I didn't feel like I had a, I had a dream. Like, the dream happened to me. Like, they said they know you hot back here in this hoodie, puto. I am a little sweaty. Sweaty body. You got sweat droplets coming down your titties. Uh, this is a good lie for once. Usually I don't have much to say and I just sit here going, uh, my, 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 my wife. Oh, oh yeah, you're not. Bo, bo, bo. You're waiting to answer questions. Yeah, I'm, I'm reading tour. questions. Show us a house tour? Fuck no. I live with too many young folks. Just gonna see a lot of Call of Duty and baby toys and Folks. Is Sunday Gems coming af coming back after? No, but my co-host of Sunday Gems has an incredible podcast with her cousin now, um, and y'all should check that out because that's really, really, really tight. What has been the highlight of my your career so far? The highlight of my career has been retiring my mom from work, uh, and she calls me all the time with these really funny phone calls where she like is doing something that she realized she couldn't do if she was at work and she's like I just want to let you know that I took I took a 30 minute shower and like I wouldn't be able to do that if I had work so I love you and like I just want to say I wouldn't be able to da 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 if I was on my way to work so I'm just really happy and I'd be geeked up so that was the the best thing that I that what is this favorite Beyonce song <sighs> my favorite Beyonce song I might sound really crazy for this but one of my favorite Beyonce songs is uh I just want to say you're my, you're mine. I don't know who that is. Um, that's a hard question. I love ladies, if you feel me, let me see you now. Does she get an allowance? The box of clothing. Oh. I got too many favorite Beyonce songs, but they change all the time, so I don't need you guys. Getting on fucking Twitter, like for real, like what's her favorite? Her favorite Beyonce song is the top five. Yeah, you gotta have a top five Beyonce. All right. I don't want any of this. Y'all good? I'm good. Thank you. It's my healthy day. No, you good? You enjoy it. You enjoy it, dude. Can I explain my tats, man? Not today. That's a lot. Juice said, you know you're the queen of Oakland, right? I think I'm, uh, I think I'm in the royal family, for sure. <laughs> Hopefully you should. I'm, I'm the something of Oakland. I do, I appreciate that. So why don't I smoke weed again? Dang. I don't know. I just, it, I mean, I went, I went, I got pregnant and being pregnant for a year, you, you know, you can't smoke weed. I mean, pregnant for a year. Being pregnant, you can't smoke weed. Um, you didn't are pregnant for a year though, no? Almost. I mean, you're pregnant for almost 10 months and then you, that postpartum time, I was uh, breastfeeding, so I didn't smoke. So, yeah, by the last time I got back around to weed, it was like, this is not the way. Hey, thank you. No, Dang, I'm, I'm, getting, I'm getting nominated to be the queen of Oakland quite a lot in this thing. I appreciate that. Come on, Turf. Turf Fiends. Am I, getting, am I getting verified? Am I getting stamped? Favorite Nicki Minaj song? Ooh. I like the new one. I like the new one. Yikes. Yikes. Damn, I don't know. Definitely one of them. Let me show my respects. <laughs> I appreciate you. I miss I miss your energy juice. Yeah, I don't smoke I don't smoke marijuana, but I I, I miss it sometimes. Um, what was I saying? Baby Nicki Minaj song. Oh uh, man, there's too many. But. All the old stuff, the old stuff, mixtape, Nikki. 
Then there's get in my bag. I'm real disrespectful. There's just too much. I'm a barb. Hi, Ben. My favorite, actually. Since when I wanted to fight you, Ben Barla, never in my life. Oh, the Nicki Minaj did a remix to the B.I.G. song. And that's my favorite Nicki Minaj song. Mm -mm. Who the hell is this calling me at 12.37 in the night? What's, what were you smoking in the toxic video? CBD. Oh, that was CBD. See, they probably thought you were just a lying ass bitch. Can you hear me other pants? I'll change my pants. Okay. Ty Dollar. What? I'm not wearing it. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. Ty Dollar. Ty Dollar son. Damn, we need to get in my live down here. Don't chicken out now, buddy. About to call you. Oh wait, Destin, will you bring me a charger for this for this phone? Yeah. Died in the middle of the live, and all this was pointless. I'm calling you El Patron. Let's see if he say yes. Oh my God, he could very much say no. You can say no if you like, you know. Here. But until he says yes. Um, Kelani and A Boogie again. I was gonna say we already did that, and that shit was cracking. I know my phone is always dying. I think. How did I quit? How did I quit? Um. How did I quit weed? I got pregnant. I just said that, but I couldn't. By the time I came back around to it, dude, it, it was like when you first smoke weed from the beginning, and you can't, cause you're weird. It made me. It made me fucking weird. I wish it didn't, because I miss, like, smoking weed with my friends. That was my shit. To have some, to give some babies. Favorite Quentin Tarantino movie? Oh, Inglorious Bastards. I know that I have a... Pulp Fiction tattoo, but that's just I couldn't think of a good and glorious bastards tattoo. And I love Tarantino in general, but something about Inglorious Bastards is just great to me. I also wish that's how Hitler actually died, because that would have been gas. He said, My boyfriend here, I love you. I'm sure he love you too, baby. How would you feel if your daughter wants to smoke weed when she's older? I mean, if she's grown, if she's at the smoking weed age, what can I say? Do I watch Queen of the South? Yes, I used to watch Queen of the South. That That's shit used to buzz. I haven't kept up, which is why I said used to, but I probably should catch up. Yeah, there's probably fire-ass new episodes. Do they still make episodes to that? Probably. She wants a lean. She wants a Gucci. I ride with some honey, some of them, how many? The pants? Oh. Chad, are you hungry? Fuck for her out and when you hear any baggies. You hungry? Run it back, run it back, run it back, run it back. They can track me. Am I caught up on Grey's Anatomy? Fuck yeah. Absolutely. I am um waiting for the new episode. Dr. Weber, love you dearly. So sad. How often do you watch Netflix? too much way too much i'm an avid watcher of everything like i if i'm not working i'm watching because i'm boring yeah that's fine look how big franklin is little fires everywhere let's get into it oh you're on season two of Grey's anatomy boy are you in for some shit boy you are in for it like you oh baby you're just in the beginning you have a lot of heartbreak headed towards a lot of heartbreak and a lot of a lot of crazy shit hey yo kittens but okay what was we getting into Franklin little Shaw. fires everywhere how do i feel about the white lady and little fires everywhere you talking about reese witherspoon girl 
girl. If I was Mia, I would have beat this shit out of Reese Witherspoon a long time ago. Okay? The longest time ago. As soon as she basically asked me to be her maid, and then start hitting me with the hey maid once I was working at her house, girl, then I would have, then, then I would have be my, no, I don't like. Franklin. I don't believe in hitting your kids. But Pearl, baby, Pearl need a punishment. Pearl need to be on timeout. Pearl needs to have her phone taken away, her book taken away, her fucking everything. She blew me to the next dimension, okay? That's why you can't let your kids hanging out with the spoiled kids, okay? But I, I, I probably might, if I was her age, I, I had to slap Pearl. Izzy, baby, Izzy, I just want to hug you. I just want to hug Izzy. And I love how they set it up like, okay, I'm not going to say too much. I feel like you and Division would make the ultimate blow your back out tracks, pr probably, and we are we talk about it all the time. I'm actually really, 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 really close with Daniel from Division, and we talk about it all the time. So it'll happen when it's supposed to. Also, the big sister, let's get into it. What's her name again? The big sister. I was talking about her on Twitter. Anyways, she getting beat up first. Nope, she getting beat up first after her mom. So technically, she's getting beat up second. Her mom has to go. But Nikita, that's my move. That's my show. Okay, Nikita is a slap. Nikita and um, Quantico. The bruise is killing you. I know. I know. My forehead bruise is killing me too. What a time to be alive. Watch Little Fires Everywhere. It's so good. 11 out of 10 series. The writing was incredible. I've never seen a show where they flip the perspective so much like that. Is the guitar center stuff? Guitar center? What is it? Oh, it's to set up my recording stuff. Killing Eve is Killing Eve worth watching? I just love Sandra Oh personally, so I watch anything with Sandra Oh in it because I love her in Grey's Anatomy. And one time I had a sex dream about her, and I can't explain it. So. Let's not talk about it. Moving on. The Stranger... I didn't like the stranger. Is that the one where the strange, the like the people they don't know keep walking up to them and like telling them like a deep dark secret and like extorting them? I didn't like it. I couldn't follow it. Are you and Cardi good? Yeah. People keep asking me that. Did something happen? I hope not. It's a lot going on in the world. I love Cardi. She knows that. Money heist, you know, having a baby and having to watch something with subtitles, you can't. You can't. I just can't. How did we get stuck in Netflix? A Piggy Paulo Jetson. Hey, cousin. Ozark, snap, gang. What's up with when we are, we have left all funk, smoke, and beef in the past. We are vegetarians, people. Did I eat Centoya Brown documentary? I didn't eat the documentary, but I didn't watch it either, so. Euphoria, of course, that's my sister. The 100, I have a sister on The 100 too, who's also on The Sabrina Show. Have I watched Weeds? Weeds? 
is one of my favorite shows of all time. They did the fuck out of that. But then towards the end of it, I know that they just, like, ran out of, like, shit to do. Like, they started, like... Just putting her through the maniest anything they could think of. Oh, don't don't watch the Centoya documentary. Okay, she's gonna put out her own. So we supposed to be boycotting Netflix one because it got put out without permission. I did see that. Yeah, Weeds got bumped towards the end. It got lazy and bumped for sure. That's the worst. But Weeds is one of my favorite shows of all time for sure. Are these K's press ons? No. These is nails that got done. What? No, it's not real. I think I would hope God. I said I hope. Oh my God. Oh my God. Wasting my time on Empire. You know what? I seen this tweet that I don't think I ever related to more, and it said that we all. Stop what we all, what was it? Fuck. It said we all just, just, just left off that one episode of, of Empire and never, and never went back. And I used to want to be on Empire, not for nothing. And also, we owe Jesse Smollett an apology, I think. I'm pretty sure. I don't know where that ended off, but I'm pretty sure it ended up with everybody owing him an apology. Love that guy. Yeah, Empire was Empire was five because it was like fake way gangsta a little bit. Oh, oh, we don't know. It is the lies their li I don't know. I don't know what happened with that. Honestly, I should have just shut my mouth. <laughs> Insecure, yes. Power, yes. Do I watch Power? Okay. Lock and Key. I also fuck with Lock and Key Heavy. Little magical show. That shit is, is a clapper. It's a doozy. Run it back, run it back, run it back, run it back like a track meet. My mom is in this live. Reese is in this live. Hi, Reese. B.B. Borelli's in this live. Hey, All-American. All-American is fine, too. I don't know how people, how British people do Compton accents, but he kind of snapped a little bit. Can we stop talking about shows? Because I've been talking about shows for like 10 minutes. Hi, Darshell. Ain't it a good life? I know. I'm entertaining. Hi, Ray. Y'all, Ray Black is the shit. Go peep the music. She is so fire. Reese and BB link up. Wow, I'm loving this. Loving the fusion. Reese, you see I'm practicing? <laughs> on my block? Y'all know I love on my block. Okay, well, I'm not answering music questions about my album because it's coming so soon. Don't you just want to wait? Give me a little tits. I can't give him a little tease. Give me a little tits. What's my favorite cuisine? Thai food. It's supposed Thai to... food. Ain't it supposed to be on the left? Yeah, this 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 my ring hand. Run it back, run it back, run it back, run it back. <laughs> Why you got that stuck in my head? Run it back, run it back, run it back, run it back. Get your music. My favorite food, Thai food. I also love pho. Too much. Like, I oh, probably fuck. eat pho a lot. Then I love Jamaican food. Then I love Burmese food. <sighs> Burmese food? And the only reason it's not number one on there is because... There's none in L.A. Don't not good. Yeah, it's not. It, is it supposed to be... Is your ring finger on your right? No, your left. Your left. So my ring finger is on... It's, it's on the right finger. Reese, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, fit, lean cuisine or kid cuisine? Definitely kid cuisine. Neither. 
Ugh. I mean, I'm not eating neither at this point in my life, but I don't think I ever just willingly went and fucked with a lean cuisine as my grandma loves mm. lean cuisine. Nigerian food, smack. Love it. Jollof, love it. What a Jamaican smack. It is the left hand. This is my left hand. Okay, I'm confused. Are you correcting me or are you affirming me? Hi, Shaka. I miss you and I love you and I hope you're having so much fun in Thailand and I wish I was there because oh, wow. that seems like the best place to be quarantined. We were just talking about Thai food. We was. I do know the hands. I'm the one who said it. You ever had Moroccan food? I've never had Moroccan food. I've definitely had Eritrean food. I've never had Eritrean food. I have and I definitely love Ethiopian food and I definitely love Eritrean food. I really want to try Eritrean food. So cool. we are wrong. I'm confused. Reese, you stressing me it's out. It's your left hand. Hi, Heaven. How's it going? Heaven, you have the most adorable voice. I love that name, Heaven. Heaven Marina, y'all. Check the music. She raps. Y'all looking for a gay rapper? She's a gay rapper. And we don't have enough of those. And she be going crazy from the Bay. Dominican food, mangu, smack, super smack. Totones. Toto. Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber is in the live. I love you too, dude. Justin, you need to say hi to my live for like 0.5 seconds. Comment if you're down. Just come in and say hi and tell the people, Afghan hey, and tell the people what's going on in your life real quick. Two seconds. Because I'm not doing anything. I'm just sitting here. Collab with Justin. We definitely collab. You can check it out on his album that he just released. Go get that. Go get changes. Was your pregnancy smooth? Was my pregnancy smooth? Mm. Yeah, kind of. Oh, I can finally show that man in my garage. Justin, you want to see my garage? Frank? Um, you're welcome, Heaven. Do you believe in life after love? I mean, honestly. Do you believe in love after love? Hey, oops, 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 oops. I think Justin Bieber should remix every song that ever said believe in it and just say believe and give us a whole... Wow. Fucking album of Believe. Wow. Like, there can be miracles when you believe. No? Destin wants another one. Are you thinking of one that's on your face back there? Like, oh, a miracle. But you gotta think of another one. Um, that's made me believe it. Oh, <laughs> uh, what else? Mm. God, I don't fucking know. I don't know. That that was a great one. The first one was good. I know. When you believe. So good. <laughs> I don't know anymore. I be oh, we're not singing that one. We he's canceled. I almost read that out loud. Woo! Shit. You like Scorpios? No. <laughs> Reese. Now Reese. Now Reese. We was avoiding that one. Reese. Read the room, Reese. Read the room. Okay. I'm kidding. Don't know if Scorpios come attack me later. I was I was joking. I like Scorpios. I like Trust them. and Believe. Mm. Oh, good one. God, we need more. Oh. I'm gonna give him a list. Really? Um, that wasn't no. Do I get along with Libras? I do, yes. Libras be lying, boy. Lying, lying, Libras, but now nah, they're super fun. They are fun. They're very fun. Funny people are usually Libras and Cancers. Cancers, hilarious. My mother. Hilarious. Don't stop believing. Yes. Hold on to that feeling. 
Leos, I love Leos. <laughs> Scorpios, gotta love y'all. Intense, love it. Gemini's, love. It. Honestly, I don't really. I'm not gonna ever say I don't like a sign. I have to see your whole. Run I have to see the whole chart. I have to see the whole chart. I'm not. I'm not uh, getting on nobody's sun sign. You can't do anything about that. You probably act more like your moon sign than your sun sign. So, worry about that, sweetheart. Sweet dirt. Oh, I can't believe it. That's oh, ooh, one. ooh, she all on me. Come on. That's a good one. God, we're gonna we're gonna make him a playlist, dude. What about other tours? I love other tours. All we do is lay there in silence and eat. I love other tours. Me and Zoe. All we do is lay there and fucking eat. That's it. Oh, ouch. Are you in? No, I'm single. Yeah, we're not together. Haven't been. Yeah, I gotta see the whole thing, baby. I gotta see the whole thing. I wanna share my chart with you and see what you think. <laughs> Space Oddity Kelly. Space Oddity Kelly, let us see that chart. Cause honestly, you is a chart I would like to know. How easy or difficult is it to come out with a collab? It depends. It depends on how fast the other collaborator is. It depends on if we are doing it in the same room. Depends on, you know, depends on those. Scorpio sun, Sag moon, cap rising. Mm, that cap rising make you a little less crazy. <laughs> Them other ones, baby. Them other ones, it's crazy. Basically, just my ex-girlfriend. My ex-girlfriend is a Scorpio. No, she's a Sag with a Scorpio moon. Scorpio moon. We in the game. Ooh, ooh, fuck it up, David. Oh, look at the moves. I wish y'all could see this. Holy shit. Whoa, fuck it up. Y'all need to see this, but I, you'll be able to see it if I show you. No, I'm just kidding, Alex Vaughn. You're actually great, so don't worry about it. You're good. I'm not going through everybody's charts on here. If I could do versus, like a versus battle, I do not qualify to have a versus battle with anyone. What? I would have a versus battle with another Grey's Anatomy fan about Grey's Anatomy facts. Boom, sponsor that, Swiss Beats. Fuck. Sponsor that. Debbie Allen. Ellen Pompeo. Let's get it. Oh, wow. This is supposed to be like a... Yeah, it's dirty. No, it's not. And it's it's a mar stink. It's dirty right it's there. It's marble. It's dirty right uh... there. Get it off. Ew. Yeah, I don't know why y'all thought I qualified. I mean, you, you didn't think I qualified. You said if I could, which I can't, so. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> buddy. Oh, Virgos. Yeah, Virgos. You guys are, uh, I love it. The best episode is the hospital shooting. You're traumatic. <laughs> Trauma button. Crazy. Collab with Lil Nas. I would actually love to collab with Lil Nas. I just love the whole vibe. A Pisces. I'm not talking about much, no more astrology. Hydrate, sis. I'm pretty hydrated. What? Did I say something like I was thirsty? Did I? I'm trying to remember. That's how I remember it. Last book you read. Come on, library. Last, the last book I read. Come on, library. <laughs> the last book I read is The uh, the Mastery of Love by Don Miguel Ruiz. And there's this really, part, there's this part, well, I'm kind of finishing it right now, but I love the part where he's talking about if you, want a, if you want a cat, you get a cat. You don't go get a dog or a chicken or a cow when you want a cat. You get a cat. 
So why do we go looking mm. for love like that? I like, I want a cat, we, but I'll take a goat. I'll take a goat. Then we spend the whole time what resenting goat. the goat for not being a okay. cat. That's tea. You need to go find your cat, dude. Go get your fucking cat. Go date your cat. Like, so you know? So right now I'm at the place where I'm like, I got to stop dating goats when I want cats. So, you know. Hi, Tony. The Macarena or the Cha-Cha Slide? Cha-Cha Slide, because I don't know what the Macarena says, but I do fuck with the Macarena dance. Very much so. Yeah, this live been going on for like an hour. Keep going. I'll keep going into my channel mode. This was this might be my best live ever. No bullshit. Unless Kelani Protective Services is still in here and they probably fuck around and seen all my lives and y'all know if there's a better live than this. No, we got some legendary lives. Like when I used to be on tour and shit, I used to be in some fire lives. Sammy, wanna get in my live? So we can test our twinmanship. Sammy, I'm calling you out, fool. Oh, oh, I look a hot mess. You don't. I can't even hear you. Hold up. Look who it is, y'all. It me. It's Sammy. <laughs> oh, hack daddy. Hack Daddy was the best live. Oh my God! Hey Sammy, girl. Hey Sammy. What are you guys doing? Existing. Nothing at all. Existing. Existing. Sitting here. I was supposed to be editing a video, but I got distracted, and I'm totally fine with that because I don't feel like doing that right now. I feel that. I feel like that's all I do is edit all day. All day long. Yeah, you like a you out here now. You gotta you gotta you gotta do the posts and the the <laughs> pictures and you are you on I'm YouTube trying. yet? On YouTube, yeah. Okay. On, Set it with the two. Mm -hmm. the two. <laughs> I'm ready for this quarantine to be over. Man. Yeah, I mean you fuck around was already quarantined on on TV. On TV. Like listen, okay, listen, listen, listen. That was way worse. <laughs> Because oh, everybody should just be outside if you just have Yeah, to. well, because, like, I mean, it was my choice to be there, for one. Yeah. Right. And so that kind of makes it a little bit better because now, obviously, it's not our choice. And that kind of pisses me off that I can't, like, do whatever I want or go to the beach. Like, I go to the beach every weekend. So the fact that I haven't been able to do that in two months is driving me nuts. Yeah. But, um. Oh, because you from Miami. In the circle, you, you don't have nobody beach. with you. I mean, some people have people How with long? It. How long were you by yourself, basically? A month. Wow. Oh, a month? I mean, it came out, to, I think it's like three weeks. It's like three, 15 days, exactly, like, that That I was in the, the filming apartment. But, yeah, I was in the UK for a month. And it was hot. Like, they had LED lights. That was in the around UK? Around the whole apartment. Yeah. That's a UK show? Or just films in the UK? Yeah, yeah. It was a UK show first. Wow. Oh, geez. They filmed one season in the UK. Netflix saw that shit and was like, and then they made their US version, but the UK kept the UK version. So the US made, like, Netflix made US, Brazil, and France. French. Whoa. And y'all don't have your phones. Listen to me when I tell you I landed, okay? And they were like, I had to give them my passport, my ID, my debit card. My phone, like That's everything. Wild. And he, like, before you go into anything, they have like three people that like pretty much dump out your suitcases and go through your shit. So what the fuck did you do all day? Ah! I read um the um oh my god what I, why do I forget the book? I read it like three times. The Wizard of Oz, but the original Wizard of Oz. Wow. And I made like friendship bracelets. They give us a little goodie box of stuff when you first get in. So and mean, how like, often do y'all be talking to each other on the little TV? Not as much as it seems, Bill. <laughs> I mean, it, <laughs> to be like, fair, it don't seem like a lot. It's not. No, it's not. And, like, it's really cut up. I mean, they did a really good job editing, but um, we would go hours. Like, I would, sometimes I would be just chilling in the, like, in the apartment for, like, six, seven hours, like, 
No music, no TV, no nothing. You can't yeah. have music and TV? You can't have music because of copyright reasons. Like, they only, um, you know, oh, the in case they we... keep something in his music. Mm -hmm. Whoa. I couldn't even sing. I couldn't even sing. There was one point where I was singing a song. I was singing, I think I was singing Ariana Grande or something. And they were like, they came over the, like the loudspeaker and they were like, you can't sing. And I was like, what do you mean? They're like, you can't sing. Like, no songs that we would have trouble copywriting. And Hi, Philip like, Lim. Love you. Okay, go ahead. What could I sing? And they were like, just hum. <laughs> I was like, what am I hum? Nah, that's many. I couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. It's crazy. Yeah, I love spicy. Ah! I got to come to Miami because I secretly really love Miami, but I also really love Vegas, and I'm wondering if something's wrong with me. So you're from Miami? No, I'm from Philly. Well, oh. Delaware County, like 15 minutes from. Why did I oh, think you was from Miami? Because Everyone does. Him? It's because they made me say on the show that I was from Miami, Florida, because one of the other guys on the show, Ed and his mom, they're from Conshohocken, which is like a, literally like a county over from mine. So they didn't want us to be from like the same place. Mm. Oh, that's and real they said spicy. it just looked better right. that I was from Miami. Whatever I just ate. Yeah, this thing is very <laughs> spicy. What? What type of shit is that? And I love spicy. Yeah. Like you know what's funny? Um, you came to Miami and you were at eleven during I forget something. Our basil. Maybe yeah. Oh yeah. And um, it's a blur. I, so I used to work. I used to work at eleven for like okay. a year. Okay. And my, my boyfriend still works there. And he texted me. He was like, your girl's here. And I was like, of course. Mm -hmm. Well, let me course. tell you. I was in Miami for like, I mean, I was in 11, like four nights in a row. Okay. Mm -hmm. It was terrible. Crazy. It was terrible. Like, I. I it's just, fun, though. <laughs> you get stuck. I got to the point of the last day where I start looking around and I'm like, I'm ashamed <laughs> of myself. <laughs> I'm ashamed of myself. Like, I'm in this bitch again. Would you consider 11 a strip club? Uh, yeah. I mean, when I tell Kinda. people about it, I say, I say like an ultra club because they're not like naked. You, right. you know what I mean? It's just topless unless you get like private rooms and stuff. But I mean, for people that live around here, they call it the strip club. They say, let's go to the strip club. And that's what they talk about. But when people out of town come, they're like, this isn't a strip club. Mm -hmm. Well, baby, I was in the strip club four nights in a row burnt out yeah it's kind of a strip club how'd you call it's her? fun though like, it is fun it is fun and it's I dark got, and then you come out and it's still daytime i got way too drunk mm -hmm. i got so drunk i was just like i'm telling you i started being disappointed in myself <laughs> and i started looking at Start myself in the mirror them. in the hotel room like who the fuck are you i don't even know you anymore mm -hmm. it's a vortex I always contemplate get like up. getting a little spot in Miami and then I'm like, would I actually get anything done? Because I feel like I would just have way too much fun. Yeah, it's crazy. When I first moved here the first like seven months, I would say I was like just the, probably the worst human being that I probably could have ever been <laughs> for a good like six, seven months. I would definitely <laughs> like trash if I lived in Miami. I would be trash. It was bad. I, I was be... in every club with every promoter, every... Oh, yeah. Everything. I would be a walking 1942 bottle if mm -hmm. I lived oh. in Miami. Nah. I would be a tequila bottle. I got drunk for my birthday, which was like a couple weeks ago, or a week ago, and I hadn't been drunk in so long, and I'm pretty sure that I went to sleep on the bathroom floor. <laughs> I have to give up drinking because it just doesn't work for me. Ooh, I end up throwing up, like, every time. Every time? Literally, every oh, time. Ever since I, from the time I turned 21 and up, I throw up like every time I drink. No, you need to uh drink water in between your shots. Chase and you with need water. To chase with water. You can. Yeah, but you know home. how you just get excited. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Everybody. Thinking you can do whatever you want. But then everybody's excited for you, so everybody mm -hmm. else pouring you shit. Yep. Did they give y'all liquor in the circle? <laughs> So we could have, like, so the guys would tell me, I'm not a beer drinker, but, like, Joey and I think, um, I forget who else, but they would only allow them to have, like, one or two beers a day, like, because they didn't want us to get drunk. So, like, the UK ran the show. Like, we didn't, they no, no people from the US ran the show, and over in the UK, they're a lot different. Mm -hmm. Like, 
they don't look for that like drama craziness you know what i mean so they didn't want us getting drunk or acting a fool on tv mm -hmm. um but yeah like i asked for tequila <laughs> for one for the party and they pulled out with a bottle like this <laughs> oh <laughs> and i was like what what am i gonna do with that i don't like, that. drink all of it at once i'm like this is disrespectful yeah, I'm like, mm -hmm. what the fuck? I opened the box. This? I was so excited too. They were like, "There's, we're sending you tequila." I was like, "Okay." I get the box. I'm opening it, and it's that little. Wow. That's hilarious. That's cool though. I'm not really a drinker like that, so I mean, not anymore. So it really didn't bother me that much. I was actually really sick too when I was there. I would have been so bored. I would have fuck around had to drink. Mm-hmm. Entertain myself to or home. to, or to go to sleep. You asked to go home like three times because you were so bored Nah, i was just stressed and like they weren't i didn't like the food and if i'm not getting fed the way i yeah. want to be fed period listen i will literally cause a ruckus so i was what, what did they have you eat oh you was in the uk oh so it was uk food so everything's different and the meat is processed i know it probably sounds bad but the meat is processed really healthy wait who is like, this wait who is the real antonio Tapina. That's Antonio. Oh, from the show. What up, dude? Mm -hmm. You got he got. He said he got drunk, but not. He didn't get drunk on the show. I know that for a fact. He's a liar. Yeah, I'm like I can't say I remember you faded, friend. <laughs> but um, yeah. So the meat there is processed really healthy. So like they didn't have no flavor, no spice, no, no season. season no nothing. They didn't have no season like, in the yellow apartments. They didn't have no sasson. They didn't have nothing. I'm like, oh, can y'all give me lorries? <laughs> can y'all give me something? They didn't have anything. That's Yo, that's crazy. I would have, yo, the food, I didn't even consider that factor. That would have blown me before, even worse than my phone. So, it's so different. And I'm not trying to, like, talk, talk bad, but their stuff is very, like, just bland. And so, I mean, I'll be real it was too. just not my thing. I huh? love to the UK. Yeah, all love yeah, you can. Sure. But when I go on tour, the only thing I can eat out there, <laughs> you gotta is... get Archie's. You ever had Archie's? What is that? You ever had Archie's? Shout out VQ. Shout out V. Who's that? What? Yeah, late night, VQ. Oh, VQ bussing. Also, I eat hella Jamaican food, hella African food. But you gotta have else... Archie's what when you go to the UK. It's the, best, it's the best burger place. I don't even eat burgers, bro. Oh, really? What do you eat? She, she, eat, they probably got veggie burgers. I like Nando's. vegetarian. No, I just don't eat, I don't like red meat. You Chicken know what? Song. I haven't eaten meat since March 6th. I became a pescatarian. Look at you, friend. Look at you. We love that. We love that for you. It started making my stomach hurt so bad. So I was, I used to eat steak like three times a week. Man. Yeah, so we at this, we at this point, I think, where low key meat kind of questionable right now. Questioning the whole shit. Oh, I'm questioning low key everything right now. So mm -hmm. I do fuck with Nando's, y'all. But Nando's. Oh, Nando's is fire. Nando's, Nando's is good, but Nando's not my favorite. What about Wagamama's? Wagamama, what is that, bro? You haven't had shit. Listen, <sighs> I I eat hella fish. I eat a lot of like. Yeah, I mm. think. I think Wagamama's has like ramen. I don't know. I don't remember. Oh well, that sounds good. I don't fucking know. Wagamama. Nando's is good though. I like the sauce. What's that place? Don't, don't they have? Don't they got a place called like Walk something? Some walk to walk. Walk to walk. Walk to walk bus. Really? Walk to walk bus. It's this little like walk, like Asian spot. It's pretty dope. This What's walk? It's the food. Yeah, it's like a. I think it's, it's like the pan they make it. Yeah, in. it's like the style, the way they make um, it is wok style, I think. But it's like a big ass mm -hmm. stir fry. That shit bust. Bust. Mm. See, I gotta be careful because I'm allergic to uh clams. Girl, oh, they don't just be casually putting clams and shit, but I listen, I went when I went to one of the food places there and I got seafood, I was like, wait, I'm allergic I'm to clams and mussels. And the manager came we over. We stand. We stand. Yeah, see, see. I don't even fuck with clams, bro. I don't fuck with They're so clams. bad. Oh I, can't, I won't even tell you. But that. I do because like so mussels. And I just had a scallop no, for the first time. And I Scallops are different. Come. 
They're not the same. Is that not considered? What the subject? fuck does a scallop look like in real life? Wait, like what you they're like not, not on a plate. She she's allergic to clams and mussels. Oh. I'm allergic to clams and mussels, but I can eat scallops. Wait, you can eat scallops? Can you eat, you can eat shrimp and crab? Yes. That's I just can't not. eat mussels. <laughs> right. I'm just thinking of all shells. <laughs> yeah, I'm no, I'm not allergic to shellfish in general. Like I'm, just, it's just mussels and uh, clams. Dang, I wonder what it is about about them. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> when I tell you, I had clam chowder one time. Damn. Oh, clam chowder kind of bust though. But I so good. It's my clams. favorite. And mussels are my favorite. Are my favorite, favorite, favorite thing to eat. Mussels. And I you're allergic. Mussels. Hella. Man, you better go eat some fucking oysters. Or can you eat oysters? Ain't they the same thing? Muscles no, are... they might be cousins. Oh, clam. They might be like siblings. They... I'm like scared though to try that. To be real. <laughs> Yeah, if you will look, oh damn, that's crazy. It's like crazy. instant. It's not even like it's not even like it settles and maybe digests and then I no, it's like instant. Oh, oysters are my favorite. Oh, wait, what They're kind of allergic too. reaction do you get? Do you like? Do you do like? You, did you die? It's coming out from both ends. Um, oh, poor steak. Don't do it. Okay, we'll stay away. Stay no, away. We won't do this. Yeah, it's bad. I, honestly, the first time I had like an allergic reaction to it, I thought I was gonna die. <laughs> oh, I'm but sorry. I really thought I was gonna die. I called my parents. I was like, "This is it for me. I'm sorry, guys. Bye." No, that's so bad. sad. I have no allergies, but in my head, in my head, I'm allergic. Don't they change every there. five years, though? Yeah, you're, yeah. I, do I'm they? Sure yeah, they can. Like five or seven or something. Well, I've never in the all the times I've it's been five years in my life have been allergic to anything. So, except I don't fuck with In and Out. I really didn't think I was, and then I had clam chowder and died, and then I had fr uh, steamed mussels and died again. Aww. That's unfortunate. It's a damn shame. I'm sorry. Me too. Oh, okay. One day we're gonna get you a. Uh... Don't kill me. <laughs> yeah, I was like, we're gonna don't, get you a don't, fake. Don't kill me now. A fake um muscle. Like when they oh, make they when they make good. vegan ones. I just had actually I just had vegan chicken out of tofu. It was actually good. Don't make that face. You haven't never had it. No, I have had it. I was vegan for quite a long but time. Tofu. I just hate. I hate fake meat and tofu meat be really bothering me. Except for the except except it's like chewy. nuggets. You ever had Beyond it's Meat? It's chewy. Beyond Meat bad for you. Stink a butt. Mm -mm. Impossible meat is bad. Impossible is <laughs> bad for you. Okay. Wait, can we talk about that tweet? <laughs> what? I was dying. Oh, yes, <laughs> That man. That man said, and that's why he called me stink a butt. That was Whoa. Really good, I had to get it out. I was laughing at that for like 45 minutes. I came back to that tweet so many times. I'm fucking weak. What was the original? Oh, you you and his DMs, I'm under his covers farting. <laughs> we not the same. <laughs> you know what word I hate? Drum roll, please. Drum roll me. I hate the word poop. Like I got Poops? Poops. Like instead Poops. of fart. Poop. Oh, like I put it. I hate put it. Oh. <laughs> Don't say it again. I hate it. <laughs> no, it really bothers me. It's like how moist bothers some people. Uh, like moist. You hate moist. Hate moist. I hate pus. Poop makes me like. I'm eating sock. <laughs> That's it for me. I'm like. <sighs> Oh. I'll start gagging. But y'all hate that because of the visual it gives you. I just hate the word pooped. It just sounds nasty, though. Just, it's not even about the visual. Poop Before is just like my little bad cousin say poop. Like I my little it. bad cousin, like I pooped it. I'm like, no, shut up. Say you farted. I don't know. I hate poop. Like that's so funny. Like um, my babysitter, like a long time ago, like my family don't care about nothing you say. And I would say, ew, you just farted. And she'd be like, we don't say that in the house. We say poo. No. So that made me think of that. Yeah, it's the way to wear poo leave the tongue. Yes, also, Gabby, with, it's the way you roll off. I also hate with it. Puss. Say what? <laughs> that just sound nasty. 
I know, right? <laughs> And I feel like that word automatically brings so much so much to my head. Like oh my god! And smell. Whatever you know what weird word? Is in my eye. Yeah, me too. I'm like that chicken. I'm putting <laughs> okay. it up. Oh, fuck. this is dangerous. Um, you, oh fuck. You know what? Also, blink. I hate? Don't rub. Blink. Oh, oh. You know a weird word I enjoy though? Not hate. Coochie. Huh. <laughs> Why he say it and then die like that? He said coochie. I love saying coochie. <laughs> okay, right? I can understand that. Right. That one's a favorite. Oh my god, my eyeball! You know what I say though? Kuka. I like to say kuka a lot. Kuka. <laughs> That's what. Kuka. No, because I got this chicken flavor in my mouth. That's it's why hot. Like it's now. spicy. It's not even a good. Spicy. This doesn't look enjoyable, y'all. No. No, yeah, we I'm both low key dying over here. I don't know what that was. What did you order? It's barbecue. in my face. I don't know what kind of barbecue right, that well, was. Well, I love y'all, but I got to do a podcast okay. now. Go do your podcast. Thanks for coming on my live. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Y'all. Yo, I have spicy chicken in my eye. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. I've been on here for 96 minutes. Oh, fuck. Who else we bringing on the live? Gabe. Gabe. Gabe, come on the live. Why not? Shabam! Shabam! We, we going circle crazy in this bitch. <laughs> he said no. <laughs> he said, Shabam said, fuck me. <laughs> We going to circle crazy in this bitch, Denise. <laughs> she won't say he not going for none of it. I'm weak. God, I have spicy chicken in my face. If y'all only knew how this felt, I could cry. Shuby, Shuby, why won't you come in my live, dude? I'm trying to get you in my live. We're going to circle crazy. We're going circle. <laughs> <laughs> We're going circle crazy. If I could only figure out how to make my eyes stop <laughs> burning. Like, right? I'm just Hi, Simone. Oh my God. My friend Simone from high school is in here. What up, man? Shoe Bomb don't want to join the live, bro. I can't figure out how to. I, I'm trying to. You have to, like. You have to request me, Shoe Bomb. Well, Gabe said. Shaboing boing. Shuby, request my live because I can't. I For some reason, I can't. Uh, I can't request you, friend. Friend of mine. Young Bay is here. Shout out Black Ink Crew. You know I love y'all. You love know I Bae. love y'all. I love Bay too. Should we ask Bay to get Bae in the live? Bay, get on my live. I just want to see your baby. Yo, oh baby! My God! Oh, Nico! Nico, you're famous! <laughs> this is so random. Oh my God, look at me. I look crazy. You don't look crazy. <laughs> oh my God, okay, you guys can see him. He's so I love normal. your music. Like I said, your music is the bomb. I love your music. I've lasted <laughs> all day, every day. When Thank I you. Cry, when I pass. When I take a shower, you give me life. Aww. Thank you. And I be watching this, the freak. We. Baby, <laughs> we be watching Black Ink. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, my God. I'm going to have to get a, a tattoo better. one day. Uh, look at my hair. What happened? I said, I'm going to have to get a tattoo one day. Oh, oh, oh. We got to oh do God. it. I'm dying. Oh, my God. You really? be snapping. Yeah. I'll be honored. Oh my God. Let's, let's, well, you know, one day when we can travel again and I make my way that way. Right. Oh my God. Right. Nico! Oh my God. You know my son's name? <laughs> yeah. I know your life. Oh my I mean, God. I know whatever Nico. you show me on TV. You know your name. Nico! Oh you're so God. cute. Oh, oh, flash your life. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my God. I can't. I'm like. I'm gonna call all my friends that I was on your live. <laughs> you I'm go tell them. Shot this real quick because this is crazy. Oh my! Oh my God! Oh my God! <laughs> ah! Ah! Yeah! All right! Oh my God! Oh my God! Let's.
Okay, you you care. go wipe that boy butt. Love y'all dearly. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. bye. Like, I love y'all. I love you. Jesus. Yo, we go in reality show crazy. <laughs> if you knew anything about me, you would know that I watched so many shows and I especially watched this shit at a reality show. Shuby! All right, next up, we're going back to the circle crazy. Shuby! What's up? <laughs> Oh, Kalani, stop. I'm going to have a heart attack. You're my favorite. Whoa. Oh, Kalani, I'm crazy. shitting it. Today is oh, nice. thank you. We stand. Oh, guys, I appreciate that stand. What a <laughs> Yo, you are the best, dude. Oh, Kalani. That's awesome. How are you guys doing? Honestly, you Jesus. just made my day. You made my life. This made my life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's up? <laughs> oh, all love you, know, you guys. My best friend is gonna, and I'm on my phone. I would text my best friend like, "Yo, get on this live. We love you." We was, we was texting throughout watching the entire show. Like, "Yo, Shuby is the best person on planet Earth. How are you such a great oh. person?" <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, yeah, it was a great show. Did you have fun <laughs> in the UK? Did you enjoy the food? I have to say, like, the whole thing, it was the best experience of my life. I love the food. I went to town on that Because <laughs> I didn't know how to cook, so they just kept bringing me all this food that was just so amazing. I don't know. I loved it. What did you do to pass the time? Oh, I mean, for me, I was just never bored because, like, <laughs> I was playing so much ping pong. And, like, I remember my parents told me, you know, just walk a lot in the apartment because then your mind, you're just going to be like liberated the physical liberation so i was walking like for hours in that apartment in circles just walking um, in circles oh in no circles. pun but yeah <laughs> no pun <laughs> circle but uh yeah i was just walking and no i mean truthfully the game was so quick right so like in one morning a new person would come in and then we'd have a blocking in the evening so it was like it was very quick you know wow it was yeah it, yeah you guys yeah. were quarantined before all of us right I know it was kind of like spring training for the majors. Right. <laughs> did you did you take your your circle learn skills into quarantine? I have. I've been playing a lot of ping pong. Uh, <laughs> <but>. <laughs> no, my thing is like you know I I know it sucks that we're not in the real world, but I will miss aspects of quarantine for sure. <laughs> like yeah, me too because I'm 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 kind of digging it a little bit. It's productive. I mean, yeah, I miss me like restaurants. I miss seeing my friends. I miss like the oh beach. yeah. Where are you from? Where do you live, by the way? Oh, I live in LA, but with the quarantine, I went up back to the Bay. Yeah, with the You're fam. from the Bay? <laughs> yeah, I'm from the Bay also. Oh, What's good? Oh, my whole life East Bay. Changed. Oh, my God, guess what? Whenever quarantine's up, I think we need to be real-life friends. Claudia, I honestly <laughs> think we would be, like, the best entourage, us, all of us, the crew. <laughs> I, I think I'll be there right in. in. <laughs> Oh, really? I'd be there in a second. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, when the quarantine is up. Oh, my God. Come to game now. You're probably so good at games. Oh, oh I love games. I know oh, you yeah. love games. You gave me the game vibes. <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh, wow. Thank That's you for sick. coming on my live, dude. We appreciate it. Yeah, let you. me just screenshot this. Screenshot it, bro. It. Oh, that was sick. Kalani, hey, all the love to you guys. Oh, all we right, love Christ. you, man. You have a great day. <laughs> right, oh, girl, oh. Ah, ah. I got corona. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't. I'm just saying I don't. Bye, Bye Shuby. Bye, guys. Bye. Wow. Circle crazy. <laughs> Going circle fucking crazy, dude. <laughs> all we need to talk to is Rebecca now. Listen, I think at this point, I might have just did a online circle interview reality show for free. Like I probably should have got paid for that and did that like, on a real think platform. You're sponsored. But the truth is, is I really just fucking love television. It's I don't know some people's shit is like crossword puzzles, and my shit is. Television. Achieve, achieve, you know, <laughs> I to be watching shit. My shit is. You know who I want to? You know who I want to interview? I want to talk to somebody from like 
Love is blind. They're like too hot to <laughs> handle. Love and hip hop. <laughs> love and hip hop too. I... Yeah, love and hip hop low key. Yeah. But that could get crazy. That could get crazy oh, really quick. Um, I, yeah, I want to do the love is blind. Oh my god, too hot to handle or married at first sight. Married at first sight was nuts, y'all. Have y'all seen? Lauren and Cam. Lauren and Cam. Don't we all love them? Lamron. Or like X on the Beach. Or le let me tell you, I probably watch every reality show you got X there, on the beach, there is to watch. I love X on the Beach. I love um 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 Are You the One? Are you the one? Are you the one with Yeah, I don't know why. I think that my life until maybe today and yesterday was so boring and not and not messy that like I thoroughly be entertained by human. It's like it's like fucking. It's like psychology. I don't know. I'll go on married on uh, married at first sight. I'll volunteer. At Love at first sight. Love at first sight. <laughs> okay, now what I don't watch is Ninety Day Fiance. This bitch loves that show. It's funny. That's what. Someone said, I can set you up with my homegirl, Francesca, from Too Hot to Handle. What's that, the Hot Wing Show? The Hot Wing Show? Too Hot to Handle is the one where they put them all on the island and they can't have they can't have sex with each other. They, they can't. They, 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 they juice them up like, you're about to have the sexiest summer and you're about to, you're about to give you hella alcohol and you're about to have sex. And then uh, they don't. They can't have sex, so there's that. 90 Day Fiance, just, I don't know, it'd be exploity vibes for me. I don't know. Someone said Flavor of Love, listen. You Trash. a fake celebrity. Well, I mean, hey, <clears throat> I would. I don't like being a real one, so let me just watch the challenge. Should I watch the challenge? Hi, Mariah Lynn, what's the deal? Two on ten, there's a whole vibe. Oh, that's the show that we were watching a little bit. Yeah. That shit is that shit is good. Love Island. Let me try. I tried Love Island. I, never I could not get into the narrator. It's something about the intense accent and it's so hype like the the accent is so hyper. Like whoever the narrator is, it's like so intense all the time that like I, I just I can't. Like, it's too much for me. I was like, calm down, sir. I did not fuck with it. It was not the vibes for me. Can't not tell you that. <clears throat> Temptation Island? Fuck, what is that? Is that another one I don't know about? That Should sounds like the same vibe. Too hot to yeah, it, it gives me that. No, Love Island, like, I get, like, I don't know. It's the accent. Yeah. Tila Tequila. Who's my favorite in Love is Blind? But sit, duh. But fucking sit. Okay, I think that we went very crazy on this live, and now we've been on live for, like, 100 minutes, 108 minutes to be exact, and that's a lot. That's a lot so, of minutes. I'll be back tomorrow for another live. Today was undoubtedly the best live of my life. Are you gonna go live every day I am now. Day? Yeah, I'm going to live every day to my album around 4 p.m. I would have to say, I think. I will now consider myself the king of reality shows. And uh, I'm going to see you guys tomorrow at 4 p.m. on my live. I love you guys dearly. And... Eight more days to the album. Eight, eight more days to the album. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'll see you all tomorrow.